hello guys i hope you all are doing great we are here with a new release of repair buddy wordpress plugin 3.7973 you can just install it by searching for repair buddy or downloading it from wordpress.org and activate the plugin after activating just go to types add the types you operate with brands add the brands you operate with and add some devices you operate with services and parts so in a uh, in types you can add the uh, device types you operate with and uh, if you want to change the label of type to something else like motor bike or whatever you can just go here device and brands and you can change it here and if you want to change ID me to serial number you can just do it like this so you can change uh, brands to manufacturers type to type to items whatever and here you can add as many uh, device types you want there's no limit and here you can add as many as you want brands there's no limit and here you can add uh, devices as many as you want there's no limit and here you can add the services let's see the service uh, in us in service you can set price based on this is the default price of this service but if you want to offer different price for computers or you if you want to disable this service for phones or you want to di uh, offer different price for tablets uh, similarly you can set price by brand and you can also set price by devi devices so if you want if you think that this device should be charged higher for the service whatever it is and the uh, service type is important here also select the service type after adding services you can add the some parts if you don't want to use the parts of uh, repair buddy wordpress plugin you can just use woocommerce products and uh, Woo to, uh, to to use woocommerce products go to uh, go to general settings and here you can disable parts and use WooCommerce products and it will start showing up these products as parts for your booking services all right after that you can go to short course and get your short code you like I will use this one on this page and <coughs> once you place the short code here customer can select the device type then the brand and the devices will load then they will select the device enter the IMEI or serial number whatever you have named labeled it then go in installation they will select the service they want and then they will fill out their information they will attach a file if they want and accept it and they will submit the request can you help me fix the see this is the case number both customer and both customer and uh, admin should have received an email when ad admin will see the job here that uh, like this one admin can open the job see the details he can see that which image the customer have assigned with, with, attached with it admin will perform the uh, tasks and uh, you can set taxes here you can set currency here you can set other uh, items all right customer will have the uh, customer will have my account like this and its short code also can be found here my account this is you can make customer dashboard like this so he can see his jobs here and he can see his uh, he can also open a job here and you can also use woocommerce my account as customers dashboard instead using it 
if you are already using WooCommerce My Account page, then you don't need to use two pages uh, separately. All right. So he, uh, and here, customer can check the status of their device. Here customer can check the status of their device online. They just have to enter the custom, uh, their email. Do, you can make this page uh, getting shortcut here, status form, and customer will see what is happening with their device. This is the history of their device and everything else. So once customer sees it like this, uh, job is being performed there is no balance let's add some part in it you can take on-site payment just enter the page you have no payment status partially paid in the balance is 18,000 I will pay 15,000 in payment method cash or swipe transaction paid on-site you already have received a payment for on, on this device from these are the payments these are the services this is the history what is being done on the job and now if you want to take the other payment uh, uh, want to uh, send WooCommerce link here you can set up online payments turn it on so you can see this option and the balance amount you can receive with online link just clicking here order generated and sent to customer and here is the WooCommerce order for 3700 and this is the link which already have been sent to customer see and if they see in their if they check the status of their job online they will also see this here that they have to pay invoice so they can go here and pay the two are here because we have generated two orders for this invoice before I just I'm just doing testing so here you can print to pay order so you can get the uh, get authorization from your customer to open their device and also f uh, signed when you have delivered the device here you can print order And here you can print labels print order will be like this and label all right it can be printed these links will be removed once they are paid okay another fe uh, uh, some feature is you can add as many st job statuses as you want you can use SMS uh, whenever device status is changed like you have co from code to in progress the SMS will go there are different types of SMS you can use booking activation SMS page payment status you can add more payment statuses here job status you can add as many job statuses as you want taxes your, your choice reports and invoices currency general settings and uh, dashboard no, uh, another awesome feature is maintenance reminders you can add a maintenance reminder to send reminder after 90 days or 60 days or uh, 365 days name it description add email body what will be sent to customer these are variables you can use and sms will also be you can also send sms and you can keep email active sms inactive reminder active you can send it for all types of devices but but just brands of dell just devices of dell brand or you can send it to all brands whatever you choose I have created here two, uh, two, remind, uh, two maintenance reminders and you can view here logs that whom the reminders have been already been sent. So 
they will be sent in with interval whatever have been selected this is how repair buddy wordpress plugin is working there are so many features in it you should uh, try to use it and you will find it very useful for your repairing business if you have more questions you can tell us and here you can add a manual log to keep your customer informed that your device is not repairable or whatever there are st statuses payment statuses upload file or you can add a file here thank you let me know if you have any question please post below